I know a whole lot of us think about this thing all the time, but let me, let me inform you that podcasting is easy. Podcasting is very easy. First, what you need is a good condenser microphone. You need a good condenser microphone. A budget-friendly microphone in that category won't be a bad idea for a start. Then you need a broadcasting desk with a laptop and a recording software like Audacity and Adobe Audition. Those are the two I use. There are several ones out there you can attempt to try, but these are the two I use, Audacity and Adobe Audition. You probably might be needing a, a mixer and a sound card, but that can come later because what we want right now is for you to start podcasting. Another major tool that you need for podcasting is yourself. You need to be relaxed and composed in order to do well in podcasting. Mainly, you need to be very relaxed. That way, your mind can be at a high productivity level. You need your mind to be at a high productivity level in order for you to do well in podcasting. Having fulfilled all righteousness, you need to sit back and create your schedule. You creating your schedule would help you align your podcast episodes so that your listeners can follow up properly. Next, you need a directory to spread your podcast to millions and millions of listeners. Now, in order for you to access these directories easily, you need a host. There are actually a handful of unpaid podcast host platforms out there. And also, there are free hosting platforms out there as well. And the Auro Vault podcasting platform is one of them. It's one of the free podcast hosting platforms. Aurova doesn't just publish your podcasts in her feeds, but also publishes them under Netting Radio podcast series to a wider range of audience. Also, your podcasts get to be aired on all her streams, which implies that your listeners get to listen to your podcast live on air every time you decide to go live rather than record. And also with Vault, you can also write articles and link them to your podcast if you want. It gives you that opportunity to do your podcast and still write articles and merge them if you really want that. You know, someone asks if they can um, record a podcast with a phone. Yes, you can record a podcast with a phone. It's very possible. But your phone needs to have a good mic in order to give you that presentable quality sound. The phone needs to have a good mic to give you a quality sound that is required for good listening. And also you need to master a quiet place where you can think and do your podcast without being disturbed. You don't even need the wind to disrupt you from doing what you love to do. And in case you want to do it among friends, yeah, that is very possible. But every one of you needs to be in a place where you can hear yourselves and speak loudly into the mic where so that every other person who is listening to you later can understand you properly podcasting is very interesting and it's um it's appealing to have you say what you want to say and have people hear you regardless of their interests a major role in podcasting advises you to be real if you're real it helps you keep your audience and it helps you build more audience based on who you are and what you say and what comes out of you naturally. This is the Radio Apprentice and I'm voicing live from the Netting Radio Studio. In case you have any questions, please visit www.orovault.com and and let's answer you. Or you can leave your questions at the comment section and I will attend to them as soon as I get to see them. Alright fam, this is the Radio Apprentice and I'm signing out. I'm signing out.